Hello, Anselm Griffin here with another YouTube tutorial featuring MATLAB. And today we just want to do an example of shear in MATLAB. Now I know there's an input command, but we just want to do it without the input command. I did it in MATLAB and I published the results to Word, so hopefully that's all right. And the file will be available in um, the description available. So just to remind you, just a screen grab here, we have scale, rotate and shear, and we're looking at shear here, and we're going to be doing shear in the x direction. So that's going to be one, the shear in the x, that's going to be zero because there's no uh, shear in the y and one here. And if I just go to the end, uh, we have blue here at the original points, and then we're going to have shear here. Uh, in the x direction. So we're on the the x axis here and they're going to, going to remain the same and then we're going to shear these points this way. So and we're doing it in the non-homogeneous way just to the simple way. So our shear factor is three here. I set up the points so zero, zero, so it's zero there and zero there. The next point is zero there. The next point is four. Then we have four, four. Then we have four, zero. And then we have zero, zero back to the beginning. So just to go down to the end, those points that I just called out, Zero, 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 four, 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 zero, and back to zero, zero. But the axis are to scale, and the reason they're to scale here is because the shear in the x there. So I've set up the points. In this here, I plotted the points, and I plotted them just here. We're using blue stars, blue asterisks. So you see down here. We're in blue and each point there is an asterisk. And in case you're wondering where's the blue asterisk gone here, we printed the red over it. When we printed the red over it, we lost the blue star with a red star. There's my shear matrix. And remember, k here is 3, so only shearing in the x direction. Good old MATLAB. We just do the shear point, so it's the shear by the points. And remember, this multiply here will do a matrix multiply. If you can remember from before, do a hold on, so we keep the same figure, and then we plot the shear points on top of the original figure, which was in the blue. And for this point, this time we're pointing them in red stars. And then I put in here, I put in a legend. So we have the sheared, the location, and then the southeast. Explain that. See, there we are, original and sheared, and the locations in the southeast. Just keep things tucked out of the way. And we put in the title. Simple shear in the x direction. Okay, so that's it. Hope that helps, and thanks very much for listening.